So I remember the other day I told y'all that I wanted some pot roast. I ended up hitting up my mom. I'm like, yo, mom, can you please make pot roast? I haven't had it since I was a kid, you know what I'm saying? She says, okay, buy the ingredients and I'm gonna make you the pot roast. Bro, I spent $70, bro. This is what she makes me. This looks nothing like that image, bro. Like, no offense, dukes, but you can take this back. You know what I'm saying? This is looking like pig slop right here, bro. This is this is not what I'm expecting. This is not how it looked when I was younger. And I'm gonna pass on it. I'm about to head to some place called District Chicken and Gyro, Gyro, however you want to pronounce it. Apparently they got some of the best gyros and some of the best chicken around. That's what people are telling me. I've never had it before. We gonna shoot out there real quick. We gonna see what's up with it. So I ain't never do like a gyro review before. So this is gonna be the first, you know what I'm saying? One on one. We gonna see what's up with it, y'all. All right, y'all, so I'm out Virginia right now at the DCG, you see it, you know what I'm saying? They got the gyros and all that stuff. We gonna see what's good with it. Hey, bro, I got a question for you. Hey, them gyros hit? I don't know, I've tried the gyros. Have you ever had this before? Tried chicken and rice, is good. Chicken and rice? Yeah. Hey, what, what you rated at a 10? It's a 10. It's a 10? Yeah. Every time, you sure, bro? Yeah, I'm sure. Get the all white right. sauce. You should get that with the white sauce? Yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. Uh, hey, he talking about get the white sauce. What, what's <laughs> that, bro? What you talking about? The spicy sauce is good. Alright. Man, talking about get the white sauce on your shit. I don't know what type of fuddy duddy shit he on, bro. You know what I'm saying? That nigga watch too much porn or something. I ain't going to lie to y'all, bro. I hate when they got the forks just sitting out there, bro. Like, you know how you go to Chipotle and the forks are just sitting there, bro? Like, for one, COVID-19 is still outside, bro. And that not, some people don't wash their hands, bro. They touching all over the forks and shit, bro. Like, come on. All right, y'all. So, I got two things. I went ahead and I got the platter. And then I got the gyro. The gyro and the platter, they're pretty much the same thing, to be honest. One comes with a pita. One doesn't come with a pita. So, off rip, I'm going to let y'all know right now. This zone is messy. They put extra white sauce on it. I seen it. Pause. You know what I'm saying? One dude, he was like, man, get extra white sauce. I'm like, hold up, shawty. You a little suspect. Fuck you want extra white sauce on your shit for, bro? You acting kind of weird right now, honestly. You're acting weird. Get the fuck away from me, bro. So it's got some hot sauce on it, some cucumber, some lettuce, some lamb. And that's pretty much all that they got up on this bad boy. You seen in that shot, that Spanish nigga, he was in there chopping up that meat. You feel me? He was chopping that shit up on the spot. All of this is fresh meat. You seen what he was doing with it. Let's see what's up with it. Oh, look. I ain't gonna lie. An ingestion from the lamb. Be honest with y'all. I only had lamb a handful of times. And it's a flavorful little motherfucker. Most of the time, bro, I wouldn't really want to eat a lamb because they're so cute and cuddly. But right now, it's an exception because this shit is good. Fuck that little furry motherfucker. You feel me? It's seasoned up to perfection. Mm. The pita bread is nice and soft. The lamb got a lot of flavor to it. The spicy sauce isn't too spicy. So, you know what I'm saying? You can give it to a kid. Give it a little kick to it, and the kid gonna be effing it up. He gonna be tearing it up. Hold up, hold up. Mm. Super juicy. You know what I'm saying? Moist as hell. This is a W Euro. It's not gonna get like a nine out of ten. That white sauce, pause. I see why young get one extra white sauce on this shit. Now we got the chicken platter. We got some chicken, some white sauce, some hot sauce, some lettuce, some cucumber, some rice, and that's about it. They don't really give you too much, and sometimes that's a good thing. Sometimes people wanna do too much and they put way too much stuff in it and then the food don't hit. You know what I'm saying? Too many combinations of flavors. Let's see what's up with this. Mm. Not 
not gonna lie to y'all. The taste kind of remind me of chicken masala a little bit. Just a tad bit. The rice definitely reminds me of the rice from the Indian food that I had the other day. The chicken is chopped up into these bite-sized little bits. So every fork food is full of chicken. Y'all be talking about go to halal guys and all that other shit. This is way better than halal guys. Halal guys got a bad rating from me. This, this is how this kind of food supposed to taste. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. I ain't, you know what I'm saying, Mediterranean or from none of them places. But I know how they food supposed to taste. Just because this is what I do. I go out and I try foods, you know what I'm saying? I know how they food supposed to taste better than they know how they food supposed to taste. And this one right here is tasting how it's supposed to taste, for sure. What do you think they put in this white sauce? Ranch. And garlic, probably. Ranch and garlic? Something else, I don't know. Something else, like what? No idea, man, you gotta ask Afghan. Looks like ranch to me. I think it's just ranch? I hope it's nothing else. All right, so what exactly am I eating? Yeah, so you got some Afghan chicken, Afghan rice, uh, some classic white sauce, some salad. Yeah, yeah, it's like it's like a, a new take on Afghan food. So this is this is all authentic Afghan food. All authentic halal food. Okay, what about halal guys? Is that halal guys is it's like a it's like McDonald's of like halal food. It's not something so, we we don't eat that that much. Yeah, it's not it's not authentic, it's right? It's not authentic. Bro, it's I'm not so, as authentic as this. Yeah, I told them that it was disgusting, bro. They they thought they thought it was yeah, good. Yeah, personally, I don't like halal guys, but yeah. DCG, I'm with it. Yeah, this don't hit him, bro. It hits, man. Hey, he gonna send me to some other places, y'all. We go, we definitely gonna try him out. Yeah, we're sending him to Crystal City Kebab Palace. So we gonna see what's up with Crystal City, y'all. All right, man. All right, brother, be safe. So I ain't going to lie to y'all, man, that Afghan food was y'all good, you feel me? I would definitely eat it again. Like, bruh, on some real Peace. stuff. What's good, fool? Bro, how you feeling? You know what I'm saying? How you doing, bro? Pretty good. Hey, I just tried that Afghan food over there, Brody. Oh, for real? Yeah. What is it called? Like, B some shit. I've never been there, but uh, hey. no way, Pete. What's, What's good, fool? How you feeling? Yeah, I bet you was.